What's up everybody, welcome to Money Management channel. My name is Andre and today it's time to do an update on HCMC stock. And as usual, first of all, a brief summary about this company for those of you who don't familiar with it. Healthier Choices Management Corporation is a holding company which focuses on providing consumers with healthier daily choices with respect to nutrition and other lifestyle alternatives. It operates through the following segments – grocery and vapor. And for now, uh, it has a market uh, cap of $446.72 million. And uh, here is their website and we have uh, two news. Uh, first uh, of it uh, was published on November the 30th, 2020, and uh, it is about uh, a patent infringement lawsuit against Philip Morris. So, it is a huge uh, lawsuit. A uh, lawsuit includes claim that Philip Morris is infringing HCMC's patent rights in connection with IQOS, an alternative tobacco product uh, marketed and sold by Philip Morris. Philip Morris claims that it is currently approaching 14 million users to its IQOS product and has reportedly invested over 3 billion in their small class tobacco products. So, it is a huge, huge uh, uh, lawsuit and uh, the uh, total amount uh, is uh, not disclosed yet and I think it won't be disclosed anytime soon but uh, all that we know that uh, Philip Morris invested more than three billion dollars in their uh, products and uh, uh, for now they have uh, 14 million users of uh, IQOS and that's why it might be a huge huge benefit for HCMC corporation uh, if they will win this lawsuit. And another uh, news was uh, published on February the 8th, uh, just uh, several days ago, and it says uh, that HCMC announced sales, sale of $5 million of preferred stock convertible into common stock initially at 150% uh, premium to company's most recent closing price. Uh, Jeff Holman, CEO of uh, HCMC, said uh, that led by our largest single long-term investor, HCMC has received an equity investment from a group of institutional investors, with the convertible preferred stock being issued uh, with an initial commercial price of $0.0024 at 150% premium to our last market close. This shows of confidence in the company's fundamentals, IP assets and prospects moving forward is inspiring. And Mr. Holman concluded, uh, we remain committed to enforcing our intellectual property right in the form of our patents against all infringers. This again applies to the tobacco industry as well as the cannabis industry. So, uh, here are two news and uh, uh, this uh, was the first uh, ignition for this price movement and uh, of course the second one and the main is uh, uh, reddit communities as like wall street bets and other communities uh, as you can see here i have a, a search result for hcmc and we have huge huge uh, discussions about this this uh, company and this stock and that's why we have this type of chart. Before we dive deep uh, into the technical analysis, please subscribe to my channel and hit the like button. Uh, this helps me and my channel a lot. We've hit our first target with flying colors. Shout out to all of you guys who hold the position and who have this, uh, who took this trade. Shout out to you guys. And. Uh, here is my second target and uh, because of uh, the price movement and the volume I think the probability of hitting this target is 50-50 uh, and uh, each next trade is become more and more risky and you have to understand this. If you want to uh, buy the share of uh, this company please follow three simple rules. First of all, do not put the money that you are not willing to lose. Uh, this is the most important rule because uh, each and every trade with this type of companies is extremely, extremely risky. You have to understand it uh, right before you open your trade app. Second one, do not go all in. And this is also very important because you have to understand all the risks. Third one, do not put your stop loss close to your enterprise. 
and this rule is because of the volatility of these uh, penny stocks uh, you can hit your stop loss price and uh, you will be kicked off uh, from the trade and you won't be able to receive uh, some profits with this risky trade and uh, here is uh, the chart and let me show you another i don't need this tool i don't need this tool and i have to measure the movement of uh, this price from here i don't think uh, uh, it will last forever and uh, i i'm sure that eventually this asset will go down and will go down heavily that's why it's up to you uh, whether you want to buy this uh, stock or not but in my opinion uh, it is still a chance to go up here to have another 50 percent from my previous call to this uh, target, uh, it was exactly the same amount of uh, profits, around 61%. And it is a third call. Uh, first of all, was at this point, as you can see here, and it was more than 200%. Second one was this one, and it was again 200%. Third one was this one and it is 50 percent and the fourth one for now it is very risky and it is here and uh, basically it is another 50 percent so uh, here is my targets uh, they are still viable and uh, for now i think we might have uh, we might have a slight uh, pullback it's not uh, obvious but uh, it might occur uh, anytime soon and uh, here is your uh, new entry points if you want to invest and if you uh, want to risk to put your money at risk here is your second one and here is your third one uh, basically uh, that's all for now please subscribe to my channel and hit the like button see you next time guys bye